thanks to Almat Logistics Intelligence, I uh, was able to test this industrial RFID reader from Baluf. And what I had to do first is to buy such a M12 plug uh, in order to power the whole thing with 24 volts. Then we have four antennas here on this RFID reader. Uh, we have these antenna cables, 10 meters. And this is a antenna. This is my Raspberry Pi which is connected via Ethernet cable, so industrial Ethernet, so there's an additional uh, overplug that you uh, can add with you want to have it uh, sandproof or dustproof. Then we have our famous screen and these are two RFID tags and I did a very low, yes, one is called Google Plus and it enters the field and when I pull it out it exits the field and the other tag is called Facebook and Facebook will now leave the field. So that's basically what you can do with these Baluf gadgets. It's really crazy. Let's take a look at the code. It's a lot of protocol stuff because it, there's a kind of uh, binary protocol that's kind of mixture of ASCII and binary. But we have commands like write to the tag where we have an EID and a yeah where we can uh, set the information uh, when we can write the information up to 12 bytes we can set the antenna voltage we can also yeah do things like yeah here's the code where i write is uh, where i write uh, the information to these tags this is the tag id and this is the eid i'm setting so EID is the field where you can store your EAN or your ISBN or whatever you want to store about the thing, thing or maybe an ID of the database. And this is my asynchronous JavaScript code. And this logs out uh, the tag information. So we can uh, check if the tag enters or leaves the field. And we can also check the TID, the EID and the slot so the number of the antenna it is printed to. So that's basically it and yeah I'm going to do lot some other experiments with it too but that's it for today.